This is the old church ruins of Camigen. Accordingly, this is the topmost where the bell is. Okay. So imagine during the time when the volcano erupted. So I'm not into history. So I don't have the specific year. Maybe let's find out here. Okay, so this is imagine this is the top of the church where the bell is. I'll read this for you. I hope that the encryption is readable. All right. Mount Vol Vulcan eruption in 1871. 6 p.m. Kota Bato, the capital of Camigan Island, was a quiet and attractive town verdant in its natural wonders its peaceful shores provided strolling grounds for its inhabitants as they bask under the gracious moonlight then suddenly tranquility came to a halt as a subterranean rumbling sowed undescribable terror hundreds of houses and the churches crumbled into pieces the ground rolled and broke into deep crevices with horrifying earthquake served only as a prelude to the destructive climax never witnessed before mount vulcan gave out its fiercest and most violent outbreak 6.20 p.m. Kota Bato was but a dreadful pile of ruins. The single volcanic eruption buried a beautiful town into obscurity. Hundreds of lives were lost, while survivors sought refuge in the open country that gave them hope for tomorrow. So, yeah. This is it. This is where the church is located. And this town was buried with the volcanic ruins. There you go. Let's try to find out what's inside here. What's at the back. There used to be some grasses here before where during the Holy Week people will stay here and sleep and rest because of the shady area and it's so quiet let's find out been here like more than 10 years already here oh nice i love it Mm. The perfect place where everybody can rest. I love it. Imagine how big the church is. 